This video does not advocate violence. The video was created for scientific and educational purposes only. The video shows the process of feeding mantises. Warning. Some scenes in the video may be unpleasant for viewers. If you are an impressionable person, please do not watch this video. Today we will continue to study the behavior of mantises. In previous videos we have observed how mantises hunt in the wild. We also simulated a situation where a mantis encounters an unknown object and observed the insect's behavior. Today we will test whether the mantis will attack artificial insects. For this purpose we have prepared these toy spiders. Mantises are predators. They prefer to wait in ambush for their prey. During the hunt mantises practically do not move. Due to their coloration mantises are well camouflaged. Often the victim does not suspect anything until it is in the clutches of the mantis. And now let's observe how mantises hunt real insects. This time the mantis caught an earwig. The earwig is an omnivorous insect. Earwigs are usually active during the hours of darkness. Earwigs often settle near human habitation. Earwigs cause damage to agricultural crops, but at the same time they destroy other garden pests. The coloration of mantises usually depends on their habitat. Most often green or white yellow mantises are found. However, even brown or gray mantises can be found in nature. Some species of mantises have learned to imitate the flowers of plants. With each molt, the mantis becomes more and more similar to the flower it pretends to be. For example, there are species of mantises that resemble the flowers of jasmine, orchids and other plants. Mantises feed primarily on small insects. Female mantises often prey on insects their own size or larger. There are also species of mantises that can attack small birds, frogs, rodents and lizards, among others. Mantises are not threatened by poisonous insects, they eat them without any harm to their health. In nature, mantises often hunt spiders. For this reason, we decided to choose an artificial spider as the object of the experiment. Externally, it looks quite similar to a real one. Will the mantis recognize the fake? Will the mantis attack the toy spider? Let's observe this. As it turns out, the mantis recognizes fake insects as real. The mantis attacked the toy spider and tried to eat it. We decided to end the experiment and carefully remove the artificial insect. No mantis was harmed during the filming. If you were interested, please subscribe to our channel and put a like. Here we will continue to tell interesting facts about insects. Bye, everyone.